Hello! Hello everyone! Welcome back to my channel. Now, if you thought that I was not going to give you a unique, very, very unique car, you were wrong. Because you cannot get more unique than this. Uh, what you're looking at right now, it's a 143 scale Dodge KH32. Steam, what is it, Streamline? Let me see what it is. It's a Streamline Fountain Truck. Now, and it's a Coca-Cola brand. And I hate to give brands out because I'm not getting paid to promote Coca-Cola. But let me tell you, this is such a unique car. I, will, I don't think I'm going to ask you if you've seen them in person in real life. Because this is a 1934 model, people. 1934. And let me tell you, I'm not crazy about collecting really old models like this one this was a gift to me and i is really i'm really um glad they gave me this car as a gift because it's very unique and i love unique cars you know i don't think i i will ever see them in person i don't think a museum has one of these hopefully they might around somewhere around the world I haven't seen one, but if you cannot tell me this is a unique car, look at all these details. You know, this is one good thing about back in the days. They make sure everything was so detailed. You know, you can see even the Coca-Cola, what is it, pump? Or, I don't know, barrel? I don't know what it is inside, but look at all these details. These are the, by the way, guys, these are the reverse Look how far back they had uh, the side mirrors. When would you have ever seen an American car with the side mirrors all the way by their fender and so far out? Look at this big hood in between. I think by the time you, your eye vision gets to here, you don't see nothing because it's so far out. <laughs> <laughs> that you may not even get to see the rest of the cars around you. And this must be a big, even it's a 143 scale, it's such, such a huge, huge car. And look at that horn. That's a horn right there. You can see the air vents. You can even see the floor. Was the floor? Um, floor. No, not the floor, the foot. It's like a like the stand for you to get in the car. The metal sheet right there. It's such a... The white wheels, I'm crazy for that. I love when these classic cars, they put the white wheels around. It's just... It gives it a nice, classy, classy touch. And look at this. This is so weird. It's like I'm trying to figure out... Believe me, and I have this car for a few weeks, a few months probably, and I'm still trying to figure out what is it really like. This is a pump that will pump the soda to the customer. I see a little handle there, so probably people put their cup there. But wow, that's such a work. <laughs> I guess back in the days, in 1934, they did not sell no Coca-Cola in the supermarket. And I'm not trying to be funny. I'm not trying to be smart. I do not have that info. So please do not take it personal. If I'm saying something wrong, maybe they were selling soda back then. I do not know. I'm trying to understand this car. But I'm just looking at all these little details on how cute it is. Back in the days when Dodge was such an important brand in America. Dodge, Ford, Chevrolet, Chrysler. These were the bread and butter brands. Buick, Oldsmobile, Pontiac. But unfortunately, some of these brands are no longer in existence. Like Oldsmobile, Pontiac. We do not have no long Plymouth. We do not have it anymore. You know, Mercury, unfortunately, is no longer in market either. But 
they still they still get stuck with us for life as memories but this is a beautiful truck it must have been huge i could see it i could see it because i, I could like i know i could just notice it look how big this section is right here the part where I guess they have the mechanical part inside here to pump the soda there. It must have been a whole work and a half. <laughs> All right, guys. So I'm going to stop talking for a minute so you can have a nice look at the car and enjoy it. All right, guys. So this this piece right here, if you're a Coca-Cola fanatic or you love to collect Coca-Cola stuff, this is a piece that you may not miss. It's just the quality. I recommend it for the quality. It looks so detailed. It looks so cute. It's It takes you, for my older folks, uh, followers, it, must, it probably takes it take you back to... Back in the days when you were a child and you remember going to these trunks to get your soda cup. I'm not even sure if that was supposed to be just to serve you soda. But I'm thinking because of the handle. I'm thinking you probably put the cup in there. This must be like bell. The bell right here. I'm not sure what. Or the lighting. It looks like the bell. Probably they used to ring the bell so you know the soda truck was outside. But it's such a beauty, such a real beauty. True classic. By the way, guys, so you know, this is my oldest vehicle. I'm talking about model-wise. This is a 1934. I do not have any other car from the 30s. Because I'm not too crazy about classic, classic cars. But this one, I was in very intrigued. I love classics, don't get me wrong, but... I like usually 1950 and up. But this is a beauty. Guys, uh, if I haven't said it before, please do not, do not forget to subscribe and click on the bell next to the subscribe button. It will remind you when I'm posting more videos. And also, if you like what you're seeing, if you like the this big Coca-Cola truck that you're looking at right now, please give me a nice thumbs, thumbs up. It will support, uh, show me support. And also comment. I would love to read your comments and let me know what you guys think. If you're enjoying what you're seeing. You know, like I always say, I love doing this. I enjoy doing this. And that's the most important part. And I enjoy sharing my collection with you guys okay so take care of yourselves and i'll see you on the next video goodbye